Hello there, and welcome to my study. This is where the writing gets done. You've just missed me doing my commute, which consists of walking downstairs. Um, I come down and usually, in theory, sit uh, here and write about two, three thousand words a day. And in theory, again, um, work an eight hour day. Uh, the practice is rather more complicated. Sometimes it involves getting up at 4 a.m. and having a virtually the whole day's work done by breakfast time. Um, which apart from feeling a bit tired in the afternoon is a very good thing. I, I usually work at this computer rather than that one. This is the email computer. Uh, they're kept separate so that I don't get distracted um, when I'm actually writing a book. Um, whether it's a science fiction or a mainstream novel is kind of irrelevant. It's just writing a novel to me, that's what's really involved. So everything really goes on to the computer these days, um, starting with notes and uh, then the sort of finished article. Um, I really admire people who work from, you know, uh, from doing stuff by hand, but I just find it t takes too long. So although I'm a very inaccurate typist, uh, I'm quite fast, so I can, my sort of hands can keep up with my brain. Uh, Generally, I'm a sort of uh, water-fueled writer. You know, I, the end of the days when writers are all fueled by whiskey. Sadly, not me. Uh, I've, I've tried it; it doesn't work. Um, and today, my water is contained here in a rather attractive mug. Uh, this says "Flea" on it. "Flea" stands for Fife Lock Harbour Explosive Entertainments. This is a fireworks company. Me and my pal Les McFarlane started in a vain, as it turned out, attempt to get our hands on big fireworks. You're not usually allowed to buy as members of the general public. Um, all we've really got as a result of this is lots of of mugs, pens, key fobs, and a rather attractive company certificate, which I can show you here. Okay. Up here. Uh, other exciting things in the study? Well, uh, a sort of collage thing that uh, a friend of mine did about my sort of ongoing and rather pathetic uh, support uh, for Morton Football Club. Um, and an old flare pistol with the firing pin removed, I hasten to add for any health and safety people watching at the moment, um, from my dad's ship, used to be in the Admiralty, so that's what that is. Over here we have a notice board with a sort of nonsense, including uh, my very first rejection slip. Uh, from Jonathan Cape, dated 28th of the 1st, 1974, on a typewriter. Uh, then there's the unused cheque. This is for the cheque that I sent to the people who actually published my first novel, Macmillan. The cheque wasn't used because they published the manuscript rather than uh, sending it back to me. And photographs of various cars I've uh, owned over the years, and in some cases crashed as well. We have uh, Animal, who's my, always my favourite Muppet. Uh, a beer uh, from Belgium, says Mort Subit in sudden death. Uh, after that, there's this fabulous lightsaber. Uh, this is Darth's own one, actually. He uh, signed it for me, personally. And it really works. You can cut through things and everything's amazing. The rest of the study is basically comprised of books. Books and yet more books. This is the science fiction wall here. Paperbacks, uh, hardbacks, um, and lots of things like little paperweights. And over here, we have telegraph pole insulator with a golf ball on top, that's irrelevant. Um, part of my extensive collection. Beyond that, we have things like another lightsaber. After that, lots of uh, maps and books. Lots and lots of books, honest, serious amounts of books. Science fiction, mainstream, reference. And the whole thing, I guess, really reflects me, I suppose. My brain, quite big, not really that impressive, full of science fiction and mainstream, and a bit dusty.